Hey, what's going on, all my gamers and gamers? It's the one they call Top DD Dog and Overwatch Blizzard. I need to talk to you guys because Blizzard has came out with a new PTR patch update, and some of this stuff in this note is straight up craziness. It's, it's stupidness. Um, first on the list, let's talk about Anna. They have decreased Anna's damage from her uh, biotic rifle from 80 to 60. And you know, some might not like that, but to me it's not a big deal because you know, when you think Anna, you gotta think support. She's a healer on top of anything. So unless they're talking healing, then it will concern me. <laughs> so y'all ready to talk about where it concerns me? Cause that's what we're getting into next. The biotic grenade, the famous biotic grenade that Anna loves to throw down to uh, either heal herself or to heal her teammates or to reduce the, uh, I mean, to uh, damage her, add damage to the team, uh, the, the enemy team, or to kind of, you know, keep a Lucio, keep a Mercy, keep a uh, Roadhog health at bay. Um, she, th that grenade, you know, for her to throw down, uh, they reduce that damage from 60 to 30. Then they reduce her healing of that grenade from 100 to 50. So, so you tell me if I have my teammate right now. You know, I got my team on right now. They're all around me. You know, I get we kind of getting pent up. And I'm like looking at them. I see my Reinhardt or I see my, you know, I see a cluster of Reinhardt, Hanzo. I see Genji. And I'm like, you know what, guys, don't worry about it. I got y'all. I got y'all. And I get my grenade. I throw it down. You tell me it's only going to go blip, blip, blip. And steady. Blip, 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 blip. It's going to blip. <laughs> for real guys i can't get a blip, 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 blip. I, can, I can only get a blip, blip. for real come on now you know she's a healer she's a support she's supposed to get the full blip, 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 blip. Or, or at least almost you know you got a may that can ice herself up and, and then completely heal herself before coming out of the ice circle you know so you you tell me i can't have a support character to really do my job but at the same time it looks like they didn't touch her by that rifle when it comes to her healing they only touched it um, in the damage. So I'm imagining that her, uh, her biotic rifle, you know, you keep shooting your teammate while you throw it down. It's still going to be good, but I still don't see the, the need because a lot of people don't use Anna. Let's be real. Blizzard. Let's be real. A lot of people don't use Anna. That's what I was. I remember that was one of the characters that y'all was like promoting to like crazy, like Anna's coming, Anna's coming, hint, 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 Anna's coming, you know, and then when she comes, she, bam, nothing happens, <laughs> nothing happened, a lot of people don't want to use her, you know, at first, the only time she got a lot of use is when y'all first dropped her, then a lot of people figured it out and said, nope, I can't play with this character, and then when you got the people that do like her, like me, I like Anna. I always have loved Anna. I liked Anna, you know, but now you kind of make me go, um, I don't know. Because <laughs> you take her healing, you take some of her, this is, you take something that really makes Anna, Anna, her biotic grenade, and you decreased it. You decreased it on not just the damage level, but the healing level too. That's a problem, guys. That's a problem. You know, but moving on from Anna, because I can talk about that and it, it just it makes me mad. But let's talk about Junkrat. Junkrat, the only thing they done with Junkrat, he no longer gets hurt from his own explosion. So if you are doing if you are doing a uh, rip tire, uh, you're not going to get hurt from it. If it's close to you, you're not going to get hurt from it. If you are blowing up people up with your uh, your your grenade balls and you're right there in their face, and you just boom, 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 boom. You're not going to get hurt from it. It's kind of like they put you in passive mode. You're not going to get hurt from your own explosions. But when it comes to a, when it comes to another character, like a, like a Pharaoh, I guess she's still going to get hurt by her rockets, but, <laughs> you know, if she's that close. But when it comes to Junkrat, nah, he's fine. He's, he's in passive mode. So that's stupid to me. Uh, Arisa, then uh, Arisa, which is the new character, um, they have, which I, Arissa, I understand. I understand by all means. And I already know after she gets, uh, after she get delivered to both PC and PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, uh, y'all are going to end up doing another PTR and updating Arissa. <laughs> I already see it coming, you know, because PTR is going to tell you some, some things, but how PC players play the game versus console gamers. Eh, it's it's a little different. It's a little different. I've seen it. I've seen it. it's a little different, but I know it's gonna get redone. But uh, so the what they done with her though, her fusion driver magazine size lowered from two hundred to one fifty, which to me it don't sound like a big deal. Uh, supercharger 
uh, cost increase by 50%, 15%, you know, and then let's move on to my girl, Sombra, uh, stealth. They, there, there's sound effects. They said sound effects and VO distance for entering and exiting stuff reduced to 15 meters. So I guess within 15 meters, you, uh, you know, the sound effects, how you hear the sound effects, her translocator cool down, reduced from six to four. So now it'd be a shorter time for her to be able to do her, uh, use her translocator, a uh, little grenade thing that she throws. Winston barrier projection cool down now starts when the barrier is placed instead of when it ends. And then Zenyatta orb of destruction. They have kind of buff Zenyatta orb of destruction. His uh, alternate fire recovery reduced from one second to 0.6 seconds. Plus his orb of discord can now target enemies through the barrier. So well, whoever have a barrier, Reinhardt have a barrier, uh, um, the, the, uh, that new character, Arissa, anybody with a barrier, they can still get the orb of discord. And, you know, um, that way your team can still bam, 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 bam. You know, if somebody can sneak around and be able to hit them, they're still going to be doing a lot of damage to them. Or maybe it acts through the barrier, uh, the barrier. That's maybe the, what they're talking about, how it actually, you know, when you put up that orb, but discord it kind of you, you 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 know you're helping the barrier get put down a little bit faster if people was just shooting at the barrier maybe that's what they're talking about but nevertheless i wanted to tell y'all about these updates and um i wanted to give give y'all my overall conclusion little uh statement about it uh overwatch blizzard this is my main thing we love your game i love your game a lot of people i talk to love your game we play your game it's awesome we love how we get characters like not every month but it's like every other month y'all y'all keep the game new y'all keep it fresh i like i like that aspect i like that aspect we love that aspect but when it comes to some characters y'all need to leave alone period you need to leave it alone because you, let's face it, you have two sides of the community. You have the side of the community with the legit complaints, which is the character with the, which is the, the 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 users, the players that play the game, know how each character, you know, know each character's role, know how each character should be used, and they have legitimate complaints. Versus people that is new to the game, they will pick a Anna, they will pick someone in support or whatever and use them as, try to use them as a attack character, you know, and, and try to do more killing and healing. Uh, and then they will complain on your forum when it don't work out like they think it should work out. Me, I would not listen to those characters. I'd rather take someone who's been playing the game and have a legitimate uh, concern, you know, and I think, because I understand y'all can't make everybody happy, but I would rather for you guys to listen to the legitimate concerns than the than the people that's that just don't know how to use a character because each character have a role, guys. Each character, um, if I'm talking to Overwatch players, we all know this. Each character have a role. Um, Anna is her healer by far. That's why I said I don't care about her damage getting decreased from 80 to 60. I just care about that when it comes to her healing, anything healing. And they take it down from 100 to 50 with her biotic grenade. Yes, I have a problem with that. That was my main thing within the PTR that I just don't understand. Uh, Junk Rat, like I said, to, he don't get hurt by his own explosions. To me, that is stupid. He should still get hurt just like anybody else would commit suicide or do whatever if they're too close to whatever they're doing. You know, they still gonna, they can still kill themselves. But Junk Rat, he's discluded from the conversation. Nah, that don't work with me. Um, the only one I would say need to be in here is Farrah. And I'm not saying she needs to be, her damage don't need to be decreased. Nothing need to be decreased from her except for her flight. Because I think she stays in the air way too long. It's too easy to control Farrah in the air. I remember when y'all first came out with the game, the game was, it was cool. I think she was fine the way she was because I ate, I had people, especially when you hop in competitive, I had people that I seen that was staying in the air for a long period of time. And I asked them, Hey man, how you do that, man? How you do that, man? And then they're like, dude, man, hey, man, it, it takes a little time, but you just got to get used to this and get used to that. And I still couldn't do it, but they, they learned her to be able to accomplish that. But since people complain and say, well, I can't do it. How did they stay in the air that long? I can't do it. Y'all go ahead and you, you increase her flight time so she can stay in the air longer. And then you have someone like a roadhog, which is meant to get a fair out of air. Can't get a fair out of air if she goes too high. And just and just flies around. If he can't do his job that he's that he was put to me, I think he was put in the game to do. He can't even do it. 
He can only hook everybody else on the ground or whatever. Uh, or uh, like I said, if Farah is close. Other than that, y'all kind of y'all y'all took him out of the equation, you know, because every character have their own counter, you know. And I always thought Roadhog was Farah's counter, but you know, you, you kind of made that a little bit more difficult now. But guys, I I just wanted to bring y'all this update. And I want to know, I want to hear y'all thoughts about this. I want to hear y'all thoughts. Do y'all think it's cool? Do you, are you cool with it? Or you know, you have a problem with it. Let me know in the comments below. And if you can, please share this video. I want the, I want Blizzard team. I want the Blizzard team to know this because like I said, I think this is a legitimate concern. They do, they do touch a lot of characters, uh, that I think they don't even, should, <laughs> they shouldn't even touch. Like I, they're, they're talking about Bastion. I think Bastion was fine. You know, um, a lot of these characters is fine. If anything, why don't you buff Winston? Buff Winston. Make him make his gun a little bit more powerful. Make make something, you know, do something Winston. Because Winston is another character people play as, but they're kind of like, eh, eh. <laughs> but like I said, let me know in the comments below. Let me know who you think they should buff, who they should nerf, if you like the uh the patch update or you don't like the patch update. You know, let me know in the comments below. Let me know. But it's the one they call Top Diggity Dog. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. And like I said, share this video like wildfire. It's the one they call Top Diggity Dog. I'm out. Deuces.